Hello? What's up, you crumpet fucker? So who the fuck is this? Who the hell do you think it is, you dumbass Brit? Uh, I don't know, some little trap bitch basic fur? Oh my fucking god, it's Hansy Pansy. Oh, of course, Hansy Pansy. Um, who the fuck is that? The hell do you mean? You always take hits on me on your damn channel. Yeah, you might have to be a little bit more specific. Oh, no, wait, you're that little, um... Asian wannabe gangster, that's the one, yes. Asian wannabe gangster? Man, go suck the queen's tits! Anywho, I wanted to call your bitch ass to see if you wanted to do a collab. Uh, let me just check, um... Yep, I have more subscribers than you, so... I can't really see the point. Man, whatever. Are we gonna do this collab or not? Oh, oh god, okay, if we have to... But, I mean, what the fuck are we even going to do in a video? I think I got an idea. <laughs> My name's Artemis. And I'm Hansy Pansy, bitch. Back from the dead. I'm just like herpes. Just when you think I'm gone, I come back for another round. Yes, and just like herpes, most of the elite poppy furs have had to deal with you at some point. What the fuck? Anyways, on to today's video, where me and this wannabe gangster talk to you about how to make good furry YouTube videos. If there's one thing I know how to do, it's how to make good furry YouTube videos. Yes, obviously sitting on the sidelines watching all of your pop your fur friends is going to give you at least a little bit of knowledge, isn't it? Boy, I'm finna beat your ass! But for real, it's so damn simple. All you have to do is follow the same old shit that everyone else is doing, cause fuck originality, am I right? Exactly, and that can be broken down into four main types of furry YouTube videos. You've got, um, streaming, uh, random fursuit videos, critiques, and edge lord. And obviously, in terms of my format, we're just going to go through that one by one and educate your dumb little basic motherfucking ass on how to do this kind of thing. Seeing as I'm a gentleman, we'll let Hanzo go first. On YouTube, you can make any video to keep people entertained. Hi, I I'm going to do a cover of my favorite song. Help me! Fuck me! Daddy better make me choke you better! Help me! Fuck me! My tunnel love to deep though! But once you keep making more videos, you'll probably run out of ideas and get a little frustrated. I made so many goddamn videos that I'm out of ideas! Why the fuck can I come up with a fucking idea?! Then fuck YouTube, I quit! Well now you don't have to worry because you can live stream on YouTube! Making original content is hard, so just entertain your audience the lazy way! Now, if you don't have a lot of subs or you don't have a fursuit, you might not get a big audience. But if an unfunny bitch like Ascari can get to 4k subs, I'm sure you'll be just fine. Next up we got random fursuit videos. Yay, it's random furry bullshit. These are the easiest kind of videos to make because all you gotta do is suit up and fuck around. No, no, not like that. Or well, that would actually get you quite a lot of views. So why are these the easiest to make? We well, don't need to edit anything. You don't need to have any production values. You don't need to write a script. You don't even need to have any fucking talent. Just a fursuit. Just get fursuited up and just do fucking anything you want. In fact, fuck it, if you want to be even more lazy than that, then just do a video of you suiting up. Then it's gonna bring in those views and those subscribers more than just some weird fucking teenage douchebag in Under Armour's putting on bits of fur and gloves. Ignore the fact that most of the people watching those videos are going to be over 40 and heavily breathing and you should be fine. So what kind of bullshit do people like to do in fursuit for these videos? Han Hanzo, what, what do you think? What, what sort of shit should we do? Just make yourself like Gordon Ramsay and cook some good shit. Cook some shit, yes, that seems, that seems about right. Tonight on Artemis Kitchen Nightmares, Chef Artemis is not impressed by the sauce. Where's the lamb sauce? And Artemis' students fail to keep up with his tight standards. What the fuck is this? You've not even got the fucking heat on. It's fucking raw! All this and more on a new Artemis' Kitchen Nightmares. Then why don't you just do an unboxing video? <laughs> Funnily enough, I kind of uh, already did a video like that, although crap is a bit of an understatement. Hmm. Oh! I know, just go basic as fuck. Wear your fursuit, and then sit in front of a camera and talk for 45 minutes about shit no one else cares about. You know what, that's not a bad idea, although there's already one sad lonely douchebag who does all that bullshit, and uh, he's kind of cornered the market with it. Basically, these videos are reserved for people who have realized that you don't need talent or originality to hit it big on a furry YouTube. No, you just need deep pockets and a good fursuit maker. Sometimes making original content is boring, so why not critique other people's content? Make sure you choose the big furry YouTube channels to critique so you can get more views. And make sure you spice it up by starting some drama. Here's a perfect example of a critique video. Hi guys, it's Fluffy No Wolf. And I want to give my YouTube critique on Artemis. 
I don't think she makes good videos. She sounds like she's choking on the biggest, blackest dick. And she has a fursuit, and I don't, and I'm, like, jealous. Fuck you, Artemis. Thank you guys for watching. And that's it! Do exactly that and you'll get all them views! BITCH! And now we come on to what some people, including myself, would say is the best kind of video, the edgy videos. These are the videos that uh, speak those hard truths or poke fun at tricky subjects uh, that people are going to get a little bit offended about. Sometimes it could be a rant, sometimes it could be a top 10 list. But I'm fairly certain it's widely regarded that the best format for this is one of those sort of like mock guides. Almost like a how-to format, yes, I think that's... That's pretty much the pinnacle of how to do these videos. The subjects of these videos are usually about the same, or at least the same level of offence for people. Might be that you want to take the piss out of mer suiting or basic furs, I mean they're pretty fucking easy to do. For these kind of videos you've got to realise that some people might get offended and you need to give literally zero fucks about that, okay? You might have heard a little thing or two about the, uh, the YouTube algorithm, you know, that little equation on how to make good videos on YouTube that are going to take off. But well, here's my take on it. Bit of a maths question for you. If Artemis starts making a video with five fucks, and then he finishes the video and still has five fucks, then precisely how many fucks did Artemis give when he made that video? Obviously, I have a bit of an unfair advantage, as asexuals are used to not giving a fuck. <laughs> it's another joke about how I don't want to fuck anybody. <laughs> we would show you guys how to make these kind of videos, but... We don't want you guys to copy our shit, y'all motherfuckers crazy. What's with all this we bullshit? As far as I'm concerned, I'm the one leading the charge on this kind of video. Okay, shut your British crackhead sound and ass up! I have been doing this shit since Vine. You haven't even been around for a full fucking year yet, you bitch. Yep, and now Vine is dead, so I guess we know who we can thank for that one. At least it's given rise to me. Okay, I think that's everything. I think we summed it all up. All the uh, amazing ways you can make quality content uh, for furry YouTube. Or at least how basic little bitches like to copy other people when they're out of fucking ideas. Yeah, the only other thing they do is beg the attention of Poppy first so they can have a collaboration. Just so they can dig their lazy fucking ass out of a shitty hiatus. But nah, we won't go into that today, don't worry. You stupid motherfucker! <laughs> Thank you.